Well, tonight we have a very happy ending to a story that we first told you about here last month. A dog with a degenerative disease that was abandoned by its owner. It's now going to start off the new year in a loving home and with the medical attention that it needs. Here's News 8's Tina Detail. When we first introduced you to Danica here, she was just days away from being euthanized. Now, <laughs> she has the dog's life. A dog's life, living up to her race car driver name on this horse farm in Monroe. Thanks to Nicole Imbriglio, who adopted her and Connecticut Animal House, which was able to get her this cart. You can see some sores here that are healed now, but they were very raw when we first got her. Last month, New London Animal Control, which found Danica on the side of a road, told News 8 her owner never claimed her and she needed a new home to save her life. Now she has that new home and a whole new family. We just take her out for walks and we play with her. We got her a toy. We're trying to teach her how to fetch, but she hasn't quite figured it out yet. <laughs> oh, okay. Julia and Jackie are students here at West Wind's Equestrian Center. Do you look more forward to seeing the horses or her? Definitely Danica. She's <laughs> awesome, right? Yeah, definitely. But she is also sick in a way. Imbriglio says neurological tests show the reason Danica doesn't have use of her hind legs is because she has degenerative myelopathy, which will eventually take over her whole body. While there's no cure, living this active new life will add to her life. Uh, the stronger she is, the better she's going to do. And the cart really helps her keep her strength because it keeps her moving. Now, Danica's journey is going to take her to somewhere warm this winter. She's heading down to Florida for a horse show for two months. You, though, can keep in touch and find out how she's doing through her Facebook page. In Monroe, Tina Detell, News 8.